I really wanted to talk to you about this question that comes to me again and again. How to change the direction of my negative self-talk? I know even you have been troubled with your negative self-talk. Want to know how to change it? In a minute, just like one, two, three, four, five negative self-talk gone. Here is a sure shot method. Watch out. One, two, three, four, five, negative self-talk gone. Want to see the magic? Try it now. What's your thought when you really think negative of yourself? Like sometimes when I think negative of myself, I say, hey, I'm really messed up in my head. I'm really messed up. Maybe on those times, I either pick up a phone and call my friend and say, say something's wrong, help me out. Or I start thinking inside. I know you must be doing it many times. Want to change it? Here's a beautiful method. So, when I'm talking to myself, I'm having a long conversation with myself. It's as if two people are talking. And the one which is really pushing me down is saying, Hey, I'm really messed up in my mind. Look at the confirmation in that voice. The first thing you have to do is weaken that confirmation. And instead of a confirmatory tone, use a doubtful tone. You know how to use a doubtful tone. You've self-doubted so many times. So, am I messed up in my mind? I doubt so. Change the tone inside. But here's the bigger magic of it, of changing the tone. Remember those cartoon shows which you saw on television? The way Mickey Mouse talked to you. Hey, I'm Mickey. This is what, hey, I'm coming, Goofy, I'm coming here. Where are you running? Here it is, I'm there. Now, use this tone or any other cartoon tone to your self voice. Try it out, it's gonna be fun. Hey, I'm messed up, am I messed up? Oh, oh my God, hey, hey, I'm running, hey, I'm coming, I'm messed up, hey, am I messed up? Am I, am I, am I, am I, am I not on your, not on your, and keep on doing it, doing it, doing it, and change the tone of the self-talk inside, and then, that's how it is. Magic. The tone actually changes your state. Try it out yourself. And then there's another method. Do you remember your funny song? A song which you used to hear and either go into joy or just laugh. Like I remember the song. So now I'm going to use that in my self-talk. Am I messed up? Am I messed up? Oh, I'm little. Oh no, I'm okay. And this I'm singing. So now I will sing up in my self-talk. So whatever I say changes my state and when it changes my state, I sing. Auditory submodalities. This is just one little part of how auditory submodalities in self-talk work. There's a lot more in the NLP training program. Come over, join this NLP training with me. This is your coach Ashish Segal welcoming you. Thank you.